With profound, humble gratitude and love to all venerated, enlightened masters, we bow to the Almighty in soulful gratefulness for gifting us with their holy, blessed presence. May all beings be awakened by their divine grace. Part two of four. Etc. Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. Nos programs offer plusieurs langues. Veuillez visiter suprememastertv.com barre oblique schedule. Nuestros programas ofrecen varios idiomas. Visiten suprememastertv.com barre inclinada schedule. Sade program pesh karde han ane pashama. Kripa dekho suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule. Why we must keep vegetarian diet to cultivate ourselves? Yes, because we all know God is love and mercy and Buddha is compassion. If we do not uh, learn to become like them, then how shall we become one with God? How shall we live in heaven, which is a place of love and mercy? We want to learn something, we have to become that. Animal people desire life. They love life. They would run for their life. So we know they desire life. And they love to live like us. We have no right to take away their life by any means. Directly or indirectly, we should not. Please stay with us for this enlightening lecture. Supreme Master Ching Hai's lectures are not a complete meditation instruction. Please do not try alone. For free of charge guidance, please visit godsdirectcontact.org or contact any of our centers near you. Vegan, the best gift for our world. One Earth! One Earth! One Earth! One Earth! One Earth! Go vegan, go vegan, go! Go vegan, go! Go vegan, go! Go vegan, go! Today's program will be presented in English and Spanish with subtitles in Arabic Aula Cis, also known as Vietnamese, Bulgarian, Chinese, English, French, German, Hindi, Hungarian, Indonesian, Japanese, Korean, Malay, Mongolian, Persian, Polish, Portuguese, Punjabi, Russian, Spanish, Telugu, Thai, and Ukrainian or Uranian. Saludos, benévolos espectadores. Es un placer que almas tan amables y generosas como ustedes puedan estar hoy con nosotros. Soy Sami. Nosotros, los peruanos, apoyamos su noble búsqueda de encontrar un maestro iluminado que los ayude a regresar a su verdadero hogar celestial. There are 211 countries and regions which have animal people protection laws. Obey the law of your country. No more animal people slaughterhouses. No more hurting. No more murdering them to eat. To lab test or for any reason at all. Be vegan. Make peace. So be it. En la costa occidental de Sudamérica se encuentra Perú, una tierra de impresionante belleza con muchas maravillas naturales. Aquí, uno puede vislumbrar el lago navegable más alto del mundo, una de las dunas de arena más altas y una montaña de arcoíris. Perú también alberga increíbles monumentos históricos, muchos de los cuales están en la lista del Patrimonio de la Humanidad de la UNESCO. 
Estos incluyen las líneas de Nazca, geoglifos misteriosos y gigantes tallados en la tierra, en forma de personas animales, plantas y otros diseños. Perú es la tierra de los antiguos incas, los paisajes aterrazados que alguna vez fueron parte de la ciudad en el cielo de Machu Picchu, siguen siendo una maravilla para los visitantes modernos. Perú es también el lugar de origen de muchos alimentos frescos, como tomates, manís y papas. El pueblo peruano brilla con una cultura resplandeciente y vibrante. En las montañas de los Andes, la vestimenta tradicional varía según el pueblo, pero siempre es inconfundiblemente vívida en color y diseño. La música es una forma favorita de expresión creativa peruana, como el sicuri, un género tradicional que presenta danzas rítmicas acompañadas por la flauta de pan sicú. Perú también es la cuna de personas de talento, incluidos muchos escritores destacados como el Premio Nobel de Literatura Mario Vargas Llosa. Ignore those who keep telling you to be vegan. Your blood dripping mouth looks cool to Dracula. <laughs> La maestra suprema Ching Hai, vegana, es una maestra espiritual, humanitaria y artista, famosa en todo el mundo. Ha sido invitada a dar conferencias sobre el método Quan Yin de meditación en todo el mundo. Les invitamos ahora a ver Caminar por la Senda del Amor, una introducción sobre la maestra suprema Ching Hai. We'll search high and low for a little love, for a little love to bestow on all beings in all corners of existence. Supreme Master Ching Hai, vegan. La Maestra Suprema Ching Hai, como afectuosamente ha llegado a ser conocida, vive un mensaje que recorre la senda del amor. Humanitaria, renombrada, artista y visionaria espiritual, su amor y asistencia se ha extendido más allá de todas las fronteras culturales y raciales a personas de todo el mundo. Personas necesitadas y sin hogar, instituciones de investigación médica, veteranos de guerra, personas desfavorecidas, discapacitados física y mentalmente, refugiados y víctimas de desastres naturales, etc. Nosotros somos testigos de incontables recordatorios de la compasión, la característica distintiva de esta dama solidaria y de la Fundación Internacional que ha nacido a partir de su amoroso ejemplo. More love will be pouring into our consciousness and we will be aware of something. And that is the beginning. We are here to learn to grow as well as to learn to use our power, our limitless power of love and creativity in order to make a better world wherever we happen to be incarnated. No solo son los seres humanos los bendecidos beneficiarios de su bondad, las personas animales de diferentes especies son también las receptoras de su ilimitada benevolencia. Hello, you grow so big now, you. Bon appetito. I love you. Good appetite. This is one of the reasons why we should be vegan. Love for all beings, extending love. La maestra suprema Ching Hai, vegana, nació en Aulak Central, Vietnam. Durante sus primeros años se le encontraba a menudo ayudando a pacientes de hospitales, a los necesitados, así como a personas animales heridas en cualquier forma que le fuera posible. Cuando era joven, se trasladó a Europa a estudiar y continuó allí como traductora para la Cruz Roja. Pronto descubrió que el dolor y el sufrimiento existen en todos los rincones del mundo. 
y su búsqueda de un remedio para esto se convirtió en el principal objetivo de su vida. En aquel tiempo ella estaba felizmente casada con un médico alemán y aunque fue una decisión extremadamente difícil para ambos, su esposo estuvo de acuerdo en que se separaran. Ella se embarcó en lo que se convirtió en un viaje de más de dos años en busca de la comprensión espiritual. Finalmente, en los más profundos lugares del Himalaya en la India, encontró un maestro iluminado quien le impartió el método Kuan Yin, un método de meditación en la luz y el sonido celestiales internos. Tras un periodo de práctica, llegó a la iluminación total. Poco después de su regreso del Himalaya, debido a la petición sincera de los que la rodeaban, la maestra suprema Ching Hai compartió el método Quan Yin con otros, animándolos a mirar en su interior para encontrar su propia grandeza. Por medio del método Quan Yin de meditación, ellos también han alcanzado una mayor realización, alegría y paz. Al poco tiempo llegaron invitaciones desde los Estados Unidos, etc. Europa Asia Australia África y Sudamérica And keep the commandments and try to lead a more vegan life. Así como de importantes organizaciones para que la maestra suprema Ching Hai impartiera conferencias. The peace and love that we most often talk about and seek, we have within ourselves. You must look inside and find your own treasure and find the real lasting happiness. The future is in our hands. La maestra suprema Ching Hai ha desarrollado muchos talentos espontáneos que expresa por medio de pinturas y creaciones artísticas, música y poesía, joyería fina y diseño de ropa, expresando la belleza interna y externa. Los beneficios generados por sus creaciones artísticas han permitido a la maestra suprema Ching Hai crear una fuente independiente de financiación para actividades humanitarias para mantener su noble misión de asistir a los hijos de Dios en momentos de necesidad. Aunque ella no busca reconocimiento de ningún tipo, la Maestra Suprema Ching Hai ha sido galardonada en todo el mundo, por autoridades gubernamentales y organizaciones privadas en numerosas ocasiones, entre ellos el Premio Mundial de la Paz, el Premio al Liderazgo Espiritual Mundial, el Premio a la Promoción de los Derechos Humanos, el Premio Humanitario Ciudadano del Mundo, el Premio por el Extraordinario Servicio Público a la Humanidad, el Premio Gusi de la Paz 2006, la Distinción de Honor de la Semana Musical de Los Ángeles y el Primer Puesto de Plata en los 27 Premios Teli 2006. Además, el 25 de octubre y el 22 de febrero se proclamaron como el Día de la Maestra Suprema Ching Hai en los Estados Unidos. She also brings love around the world where there is hate. She brings hope where there is despair. And she brings understanding where there is misunderstanding. She is the light of a great person, an angel of mercy. Agradecer a la Suprema Maestra su liderazgo, agradecerle su optimismo, agradecerle ese don de gente que tiene que la hace tan única y tan especial. Es una impresión muy grata de ver un corazón tan noble, tan dispuesto a servir. Ella está sirviendo a todos los seres humanos, está sirviendo al planeta para salvarlo, para rescatarlo. Tiene un corazón noble, pero también un gran liderazgo. Sé que van a suceder las cosas que tienen que suceder. La Maestra Suprema Ching Hai es una de las personas verdaderamente dedicadas de esta era, ayudando a otros a encontrar y crear una hermosa visión de nuestro futuro. Muchas grandes personas en la historia han tenido un sueño, y como ella misma expresa, también la Maestra Suprema Ching Hai lo tiene. I dream that all the world will become peaceful. 
I dream that everyone becomes the Buddha. I dream that all the killing will stop. I dream that all the children will walk in peace and harmony. I dream that all the nations shake hands with each other, protect each other, and help each other. I dream that our beautiful planet will not be destroyed. It takes billions, billions, trillions of years to produce this planet, and it's so beautiful, so wonderful. I dream that it will continue, but in peace, beauty, and love. Noble people would avoid murdered animal people products. Ignore vegan talk, just do to prove. Los Estados Unidos han sido honrados en muchas ocasiones con visitas de la Maestra Suprema Ching Hai, vegana. En 1989, en respuesta al anhelo sincero de los buscadores de la verdad espiritual, ella viajó al país para impartir su sabiduría y sus reflexiones. En esta fascinante conferencia, la Maestra Suprema Ching Hai, vegana, arroja luz sobre diversos temas, como confiar en el poder interior para la autodisciplina en medio de las presiones sociales, descubrir la humildad a través de la sabiduría, superar el miedo a la muerte, y la esencia de la verdadera meditación. Ahora los invitamos a seguirnos en la parte 9 de esta esclarecedora conferencia titulada Descubrir la meditación verdadera mediante la transmisión realizada por un maestro verdadero. Preguntas y respuestas impartida por la maestra suprema Ching Hai, vegana, en San Francisco, California, Estados Unidos, el 25 de mayo de 1989. Peace for Ukraine or Ukraine. When confronted with evil, physical or spiritual, such as uh, someone will harm you or destroy you. No, no, what is that? I'm sorry. Okay, when someone will hurt you. Hurt me? Yes. Yeah. Okay, will you fight back self-defense or you just die? I just die? Yeah. You must be joking. <laughs> I won't die just like that. I will run. <laughs> I won't fight back, but I will run for my life. Yeah, anybody stupid enough would lay there and die, I won't. <laughs> Life is precious. I have a lot of things to do. Even if I don't need my body, my disciples do. If I die like that, it's, it's very irresponsible. <laughs> of course, we have to do our utmost to protect our life, because life is precious. Without life, we couldn't accomplish anything. We couldn't even come back to God without this human life. We need every minute of our human existence to come nearer to God, to realize our greatest power and our blessing power in order to help other beings who need our help. We may not need this ourselves, but we must acquire it. It is like we don't need money so desperately, but we must have money in order to provide for our kids and our wives and other needy poor persons. 
understand that? Why we must keep vegetarian diet to cultivate ourselves? Yes, because we all know God is love and mercy, and Buddha is compassion. If we do not、uh, learn to become like them, then how shall we become one with God? How shall we live in heaven, which is a place of love and mercy? We want to learn something. We have to become that. Any more people desire life, they love life. They would run for their life. So we know they desire life, and they love to live like us. We have no right to take away their life by any means, directly or indirectly. We should not. No. Do you want to get initiation today, or we leave it for another day? Hmm. Until one o'clock in the morning. Tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow's Friday. How is tomorrow Friday? You're not working. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just afraid it's inconvenient for you, not for myself. I have all the time in the world for you. I live in San Jose. I have no place in San Francisco. I don't know how to meet you. We can do that also tomorrow afternoon. Also, who is for tomorrow afternoon? Please raise your hand. Tonight. All right. Yeah, that's it. I'm considering you, not myself. Yeah. All right, then we do it tonight. And whoever cannot do it tonight, please contact us again, and we may arrange it for another day. Is that all right? In San Jose, you have to go to San Jose, and in a farmhouse. Yeah. Huh? That sounds like fun. <laughs> But we have to arrange somebody to meet you and all that. I think we do it tonight, huh? It's the same anyhow, and you go back a little bit late later. Only once in a lifetime, I think you can afford it. Yeah. Okay. Then、um, whoever wants to get initiation, please go out and ask for the information outside. And when you come back, we are ready for it. Is all right? Only once in a lifetime, I think it's not so much problem. But tomorrow you can come to see me also. Tomorrow. After initiation, you can come to see me in the farmhouse and have fun. <laughs> yeah, and that is the fun afterward. <laughs> Any time you can come, and when I'm still in America, yeah, until thirty first, you can come to see me. Then ask any question, okay? <laughs> Other people can stay and listen to the answer session. Only the one who like initiation would go out. We also have the next time will be May twenty seventh and May twenty eighth. Yeah, San Jose is、yeah. also very near. This Saturday and this Sunday, you are welcome and bring all your friends and relatives to understand more. Oh, Sunday then we can Sunday is a lecture on Sunday. Uh, twenty seventh and twenty eighth. Oh. Hmm. Ah yeah. Oh, Monday is free. So we can make initiation Monday. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, Memorial Day is a holiday.、Uh, yeah. Now,、okay. any more questions? Yes.、Mm. You say God is all, but you never explained who the Sai Ching is. Sai Ching, which means Sanjit. Sanjit, Satjit Anan, a psychic. <laughs> God is all. God is not psychic. Psychic is a lower level of our consciousness. Psychic body and psychic power is not、uh, God power. Is not the highest power, even though it's also very frightening, <laughs> very powerful. But it's not the whole. Question: Do you truly know that you have been blessed? And sent by the true God to sincerely help and rescue the lost ones that are not of this earth and universe. Yes, completely. I would not tell you otherwise. I fear to go to hell if I tell a lie. I fear God's punishment. I fear fear His judgment. I fear the Buddha's judgment. 
What are demos? Demos, demos. Demons, yes. Okay, demons. They are a little bit lower way of thinking. A lower way of existence, a little bit less loving. This is what's called demons. Less light, less love. These are demons. Anything else? How, quickly, quickly. We have no time. How does one meditate? What should be in his or her mind? How, how does one meditate? Meditation, meditate. How? How do meditation? I think you you take them here. Let me. <laughs> How does one meditate? What should be in his or her mind? Uh huh. Uh, there is nothing that should be in the mind of the meditator. But actually, it's not like that. <laughs> At the initiation, I may have the time to tell you everything. It's not to answer casually like that because you won't get it. Second is why is there an age limit on initiation? I already answered. Yeah, because of the vegan diet, or maybe the enduring power of the body and the mind, and the understanding power is diminished a little bit after some age. But I have told you already, if you are fit enough and willing to endure the um, disciplines, no problem. All the questioners still here? Yeah, still want to listen? Uh, we have to pass the time anyhow. Huh? <laughs> How do you explain the fact that in the 1940s, scientists proved that there is no ether, or yogis refer to it? What is it and how does it function? Mm -hmm. It is maybe that the scientists call it by different names. Ether. It is what the Chinese call, I think, qi. You know, it functions invisibly, and you can't just use science to prove it. I disagree with that. The scientists have invented many things, have discovered many things, but there are many things they do not know, and they could not know, and they could not discover. The simple reason is that everyone knows they use only a limited fraction of their mind, or a little part of it. We use only one-fifth or one-tenth of our mind, and we think we know everything. Oh, impossible. Oh, this is very long. I leave it out. <laughs> when one sees white light during meditation, what does it mean? It's not bad. Seeing light means that there is no darkness. What do you think psychiatrists do to help people with their problems? There are some psychiatrists, but the problems of the mentally disturbed people are deeper, deeper than just what the surface looks like. And so the psychiatrists, having not so very deep insight, uh, sometimes by solving the problem, <laughs> make it worse. Now it's not their fault, but it is the fault of the whole uh, society system. We should make everybody become enlightened, and then everything they do will be in perfect order, because they do it with wisdom, with the inner knowing, not with the limited brain guessing and false data. It's not really from their own knowing, but it's well fed by other thinking, by other psychiatrists, by other doctors, and by other things. And at a later date, they prove it is wrong, and it is too late to correct it. Most of the time, it's like that. So don't ask me what they should do. I think they should all practice the Kuan Yin method, <laughs> get enlightened, and then go back to their job, doing a better <laughs> job, being a better scientist, and helping many more patients in a better way. If you see that your father only believes in the physical things, such as science and traditional Western medicine, what are you to do? Must you do nothing when you see that he thinks that all yogis are ignorant? He thinks that if a yogi is great, he must prove it by doing a miracle, such as flying or disappearing. <laughs> what do I do about this? Ah. You know what you do about this? Keep silent 
and practice. There is nothing we can do about it. But we can, by our own practicing power and vibration, influence our family members. They will become automatically receptive to the higher power in time. By and by they will. Russia, go home now. There are 211 countries and regions which have animal people protection laws. Haiti is one of them. Haiti Penal Code A fine is incurred by those who inhumanely mistreat long harmful animal people, cause the death or injury to industrially raised animal folk belonging to others, or overload a walking animal person. Obey the law of your country. No more animal people slaughterhouses. No more hurting, no more murdering them to eat, to lab test, or for any reason at all. Be vegan. Make peace, so be it. Veganism is another word for ahimsa or non-violence, which is an all-embracing and radical inclusiveness of compassion and kindness for others, both human and non-human animals. Dr. Will Tato, Ph.D. Vegan Mañana en Palabras de Sabiduría The vegan people are less sick than the meat-eating people. So, instead, it gives you the protection. Yeah. And your mind will be calmer and you will think less. That's the good of the vegan diet. Not only the mercy quality. Why? Because we forgive. We don't take another's life, then our lives are also not at stake. Understand that? It's a lot of karma, cause and effect. So if we forgive others, others will forgive us. So we'll be more peaceful at heart. Espectadores virtuosos, gracias por su presencia hoy en Palabras de Sabiduría. Acompáñenos de nuevo mañana en descubrir la meditación verdadera mediante la transmisión realizada por un maestro verdadero. Preguntas y respuestas. A continuación viene, embellece tu entorno con un jardín, después de noticias de interés. Que los ángeles de la guarda nos sonrían siempre. Virtuous viewers, thank you for your presence today, for words of wisdom. Please join us again tomorrow for... Discover Real Meditation Through Transmission by a Real Master Part 10 of 11 Questions and Answers Coming up next is Beautify Your Environment with a Garden Right after Noteworthy News May the Guardian Angels smile upon us always Be vegan, make peace, do good deeds, hell not rich Our programs offer many languages. Please visit suprememastertv.com forward slash schedule and suprememastertv.com forward slash WOW.